I go tennis people. So this week it's all about recycling. What happens, for example, to all your tennis balls when you stop using them? Now every year there's around 325 million tennis balls which are produced. That creates quite a lot of waste. In fact, it's around 20,000 tons, which is an insane amount of plastic if you think about it. In fact, if you take all the wasted tennis balls and you stack them on top of each other, you can get three quarters to the moon. Because one thing that hasn't really happened is that the technology hasn't changed. For about 100 years, it's still the plastic in the center with a yellow fluffy thing around the top. Now, there are companies who are starting to do something about it. Breakball here in Brussels takes your old tennis balls and gives them a second life. They either take the good ones and they resell them at a much cheaper price. And the rest of them they send to Africa for people to start to enjoy tennis as well. There are other companies that take the plastic and make it into tennis courts. They repressurize the balls. You know, ask at your local club what you are doing, what they are doing with it. In fact, find out a lot more about the whole notion of recycling in tennis in our article. And get recycling. See you at the court.